Tonight, the entire show is sponsored by Jane Tim Baxter, horror writer extraordinaire. Mistress of the undead. You can put that on your website, Jane. It's quite. That's, that's a free one. It's quite likely that she herself is a vampire. I've seen pictures, and I think it's possible. She will kick your fucking ass with her sweet bam vampire powers. Sweet bam vampire? <laughs> no, bam vampire. Is that what happens on the Flintstones when Bam Bam gets bit? <laughs> <laughs> he becomes a Bam Vampire. <laughs> he bites people and goes, Bam Vampire, Bam Vampire! Uh, I would just like to elucidate even further by saying that if you wanted to read one of Jane Tim Baxter's books, um, you could go to www.smashwords.com uh, and there's some more information which we're going to put on the screen right here. It'll be in the description. You can click on it in the description and go check out her books. It's called Shadows of Dawn. Yeah, horror writing. Go to bed real late at night and turn the lights Then Just have a little reading light and read the book and get scared. Um, and uh, over in the corner, there's a... It looks to be some sort of a, some sort of an author or something He's standing and reading the book. Reading a book, I'm turning my silence. damn phone! Silencing on it. Yet. Silence! He's reading a book? Uh, she. A she, aloud? she appears to be doing a reading for about a dozen people sitting. Uh, I approach so I can hear what's going on. Uh, it's a woman, she's, she's reading from a, a horror novel. Is her name Jane Tim Baxter? <laughs> you can ask. I'm not going to interrupt her reading. Uh, she continues on, and and uh, you see that the book she's reading, it's by Jane Tim Baxter. Well. I bet it's Jane Tim Baxter. Okay. Now, at this point, would it be weird for my character to seduce Jane Tim Baxter? <laughs> <laughs> would that be inappropriate somehow? I think that would be perfectly appropriate, but Jane, it would you're going to have to pay extra for it, that. It would be appropriate. <laughs> you're going to have to pay extra. <laughs> now, wait a minute, because your character... Is, is he talented at seduction? Anyone can try to seduce. Okay, well, you try first. I just want to get to her before you. Yeah, well, I'm Because you, you can just fuck flowers all night long. I like flowers. And you cannot lie. Well, I just think all this is childish and beneath me, so you just go whatever. whatever you By want. By the way, if we need to, you know, if someone needs to cause a distraction, they're keeping their eyes on me. So if we need to cause a distraction to kill... Who are we trying to kill? <laughs> Does anybody remember? We're not trying to kill anyone. Medward Mullen? No, we're trying to ca capture We're him. trying to get the stone. No, what? <laughs> Morgan Freeman has the stone. What are you talking about? Oh, shit. We're yeah. supposed to kill him. Yes. Yes. Oh, so you were right and I was wrong. Yeah. Who were we supposed to kill? It's like uh, uh, Kathy Douglas and Danny DeVito and shit. No, did did nobody write down what Morgan Freeman told you? <laughs> oh, fuck. Can we rewind? No, we have pencils. Can we rewind? No, it's the, ho the host of the party. We just need to find out the host of the party. <laughs> you wrote down the word host. <laughs> That's fantastic. Um, I hope you're right. I listen to Jane Tim Baxter and I try to make eye contact with her. Uh, you, you do it. She's an author. She's reading her book. She looks around to the audience. She sees you. Roll uh, charisma and charisma yeah, and put it to this. Roll. and winking ability. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Charisma and expression. Uh, charisma three, expression zero. So you roll three die. What's the What's the difficulty? Uh, nine. Oh come on. She's, she's very popular. Nothing. <laughs> uh, she sort of nods at you like you would nod at a child who uh, has waved at you from uh, his dirty sand. Damn, Jane. And she continues reading onward. All right, fine. You get none of this. I casually glance over at her like it was an accident. All right. Are you <laughs> using any... I'm using charisma and... Um, what is the other Charisma one? and expression. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. <clears throat> All right. Botch. botch, we got a botch. Got botch and like but... six successes. 
Uh, she stops, pauses, she pauses reading for a bit, looks at you, makes eye contact, and winks at you. <laughs> Everyone notices because of the noise. <laughs> This episode was sponsored by Jane Tim Baxter. She is a horror author. Her books can be found here. She writes scary books, and she's a, she might be a real-life vampire, for all we know. We don't know. She's got kind of a spooky demeanor. She's spooky. <laughs> kind of creepy. I wouldn't say creepy. Well, mysterious. Creepy is how you describe the guy on the bus. <laughs> yeah. Spooky is like a... Is like a sultry temptress who's a little who's who's got a mysticism. She's a bit yeah. witchy. Yeah. Ooh, ooh witchy, witchy woman. woman. Your name ooh, is Jane Tim Baxter. Ooh, ooh, witchy, witchy woman. woman. <laughs> <laughs> So uh, when I enraptured the room, did I also enrapture uh, the uh, Jim Tim Baxter reading the... You can look and see. I would like to look and see, please. Yes, she's sort of, uh, you know, she's she may, be, she may be not so enraptured with you. Yeah. She's aware that you've enraptured some of her readers or some of her listeners, and she's not appearing to be thrilled that, like, some of her, some of her people have left her circle. Dude, she's too cool for us. That's a little aloof, I think. Adam, let's get our round four beer. I think that you should talk to her. She might have some information we can use. Yeah, talk to Jane Tim Baxter. You're not, not there. I'm you, in the room with Busey. You're in the room with Busey. I'm where the action is about to happen. She winked at me. You want me to go talk to her, my buddy? You seem to have a little bit of an end, so I want you to keep your tongue in your mouth and keep your tongue in your mouth and go over and glitter in the general direction of Jane Tim Baxter. Very see good. See if you can get any sort of information out of her without making too much of an ass out of yourself. Yeah, I'll do it. I'll do her. So you go over to Jane Tim Baxter, who is now... <clears throat> uh, she sees you, and she's reading her book. She sees you. She closes her book, and she says to the people around her, that's all for now. And they kind of walk away, and you walk up to her. Uh, hello, Jane Tim Baxter. I love your books. Especially that one character, uh, Courtney. Yes. Zephyr. Zephyr. Zephyr, of course. He's my favorite. Well, he's many people's favorite. Ah. What can I do for you? Well, this is a fun party, isn't it? Not really. Oh, you don't like it? I've been to better. Interesting. Jane, I got kind of an attitude. Would you like to go to a better party? I would. Ah. <laughs> I think that's something that I could probably arrange. Uh, why don't you do an Auspex check on her? You have the ability to read auras. Yes. I think you should do that. So, I should. So roll a Perception and Empathy, difficulty 8. Um, okay. It Ooh. looks like I got a lot of successes. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, wow. You've got like five. Uh, five successes. All right. First of all, Jane Tim Baxter is a vampire. <gasps> the truth is out. Uh, the, the aura colors are purple, which you know to be sort of aggressive mm -hmm. in a way. Mm -hmm. um, you see a, a little bit of... Uh, uh, a little bit of um, yellow, which is sort of idealistic, right? Okay. <clears throat> Dark blue, a little suspicious of you. Okay? Mm -hmm. As she should be. And uh, here's the weird one. You see sort of these uh, these black veins in the aura. And you've never seen that before. Hmm. She's a robot. <laughs> <laughs> robot vampire? Impossible. It could happen. Wow. Uh, okay, so I can't... I have no way of identifying these black veins. Veins You've never seen it before. And I can't deduce what it might be. So it's a big any, black... Do you have any in the occult? You have one dot in occult. Yeah, I've got one dot. <clears throat> so okay, what roll... could possibly be a big, roll... black, veiny... <laughs> I, 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 I... Stop, stop right there, John. 
Why don't you roll intelligence and occult? Yeah, yeah, intelligence. Uh, four and occult one. You got five dice there. Oh, it's Let's looking good. It's that. looking good. You suddenly remember hearing stories that uh, vampires who uh, who who are into diablerie, which is uh, draining vampires of younger generation than them or of, of older generation, uh, uh, will will do that to get more powerful. And they have black veins in their auras. You suddenly remember that. And so Jane Tim Baxter is not only a vampire, but she is basically a vampire cannibal <gasps> who will drain more powerful vampires than herself and kill them to take their power. Shit. Oh, Jane, that'd be naughty. Jane, you be tripping. <laughs> All right. Uh -oh. So what does he need? Well, uh, it, it depends, because he's, he's going off of the difficulty of the people around him. Their, What's their a success? Willpower. Six, seven, eight. Oh, this looks good, then. Different variations of success. I'm looking at five here. Okay. This was six. a six. Oh, that was a six. six. Another six. You're good. Four, three, two. So, okay. What about me? Does he make me disappear, too, like a winner? Yes. Uh, you both disappear, disappear from plain view. Yes. Okay. You, Invisible high five! You suddenly disappear in front of Jane Tim Baxter. Uh oh. Uh oh. And she shrugs her shoulders and says, Very well. And then goes back to reading her book. <laughs> oh. Jane, you be cold, bitch! <laughs> and I, I mean, in the most loving way, seriously. <laughs> but God! <laughs> he, he disappeared. <laughs> yes, he did. In, in fairness to Jane, he did disappear. <laughs> So I wouldn't say that she'd be cold, bitch. No, I wouldn't say that either. I think, uh, but she's not going to suck all the levels out of my life either. Not anymore, she isn't. She, she is a, a vampire uh, generation sucker. Diablo. Cammable. <laughs> Cammable. Cammable. Yes. Yes, she's, a she really enjoys camembert. She loves that cheese. So good. Sucks yeah. the cheese out of it. Okay. Oh. All, all right. All right.